All right, it's the morning. Check on the dehumidifier. It's at 45 or 47. Although I don't think that that 47 really means anything because when I turn it back on, it just goes to 70. And it's only like three quarters full this time. Even though it was running all night again. So it feels pretty dry in here and I don't think I'm gonna run it anymore because it's almost too dry for me. Like I wake up and my mouth feels dry and I don't like that. But yeah, it's uh, I guess it's Tuesday today. I uh, went to work. I uh, went to the metro, got two burritos. And here's a tip for uh, eating the burritos. You know, just uh, grab them, open them up, like so. And then take a packet of salt and pepper and just dump that in there. Mm. And that's gonna be a nice salty burrito for later. Well, I ate that right then and there. And then in the afternoon, I'm uh, well, this is after work, I'm uh, heating up the second burrito. Someone's left this like marble maze out. And uh, yeah, it's pretty cool. I'm like into this. I want to play with this marble maze more. Yeah, look at that. Anyways, there's the second burrito. And then uh, on my way home, I saw this cool alleyway. And as I got off my bike, like uh, a block or so away from my house, I must have like kicked the uh, rear brake wire loose or something. So that's kind of spooky that that can just like come undone. <laughs> without me really even noticing it like uh, I was almost home when I tried to brake and I was like oh that's not braking but the front brake was fine so yeah, that was fine and then in the afternoon I uh, decided to play Galgun for the first time Galgun is a rail shooter bishoujo video game developed by Inti Creates. Ekaro, a student cupid angel in the process of an exam, must strike a student with a love arrow, which will help the student find the love of their life. The target is protagonist, Hyundai Kadoki, an unpopular male student at the academy. However, Ekaro notices that Corona, a demon angel who is also doing a practical exam, has the same intended target of Hyundai. In an effort to strike the target first, Ekaro accidentally increases the dose of the arrows by 32 times the original intended amount. This makes every girl in school grow madly in love with Hyundai, frantically running after him in an effort to claim him as their partner. At the same time, the aforementioned demon angel is striking girls with her staff, which makes the girls love for Hyundai in a more physical fashion, which includes injuring him in a fashion similar to bondage. However, the increased dose has an unintended side effect. If Hyundai does not find his true love by sundown, he will be destined for a life alone, with no one having any affection for him, not even his relatives. Hyundai needs to search through the school to find his true love so he can confess to her before sundown. Throughout the game, the player fends off waves of female classmates using the pheromone shot, a power granted to the protagonist by Cupid. If the player shoots a girl, the pheromone shot will give them euphoria, subduing them in the process, thus preventing them from confessing their love feelings to the player that will damage the player's HP. Corona's curse girls are more difficult to subdue, requiring the player to first shoot a mini demon angel that hovers around the infected girl before the female student may be shot with the pheromone shot. All girls have a weakness, head, chest, hips, or legs. 
Hitting a girl's secret spot with the pheromone shot will give them instant ecstasy, which instantly subdues them. New to Galgan VR is the Demon Sweeper. After using the pheromone shot to shoot off the demons, you use the Demon Sweeper to vacuum the demons up. Any effect on skirts in the area is purely coincidental. Today, I only played the first two stages, and I look forward to playing more. However, I don't think I'm going to update Andrew's quest with more Galgun gameplay. I'm sorry, Mom. <laughs>